All right, well, we are back at the local soccer field. Going to fly the FT Mustang. Got a battery in her. And let's see, left, down, right, up, down, left, right, throttle, and right. We're good to go. Okay, well, let's put her in the air. I normally do an underhand toss, so uh, I'm trying to show you some, some, uh, some of the things this little plane can do. So here we go. All right. Uh, let's show you a couple of things. I was doing some touch and goes uh, and some basic maneuvers. And by basic maneuvers, I, I mean like loops rolls, hammerheads, that sort of thing. And this plane will do them all with a plum, really will. Uh, you know, plus it'll do, it'll do touch and goes pretty much all night long. You know, I mean, really. Um, but, uh, you know, hammerheads. It's slow flight is just really simply amazing. Um, Plus, I realized when I practiced, uh, when I practiced uh, some inverted, it does some inverted pretty good, and it does stalls pretty good. Um, <laughs> you are not going to believe this plane's stall capabilities. By that, by that I mean stall is in stall is in watch. I'm gonna hold the box up. We're gonna give it full up elevator. There's full up elevator right now. There's no throttle. There's full up elevator, and as you can see, I still have aileron control. She's mushing. She's mushing forward, just dropping her nose. I have full aileron control. She didn't want to drop a wing. Um, just amazing. I mean, seriously, seriously. Let me show you that one more time. Let me show you that one more time. This is one of its most remarkable features, I think. I really do. Uh, so we're gonna go up. Uh, you know what, let me bring her around here, get, get her a little bit higher. That way you can really watch her mush. I mean, this thing, it's just amazing. All right, so we're gonna bring her into the wind. We're going to kill a throttle. I'm going to go full up elevator. Now watch this. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. The prop's windmilling, by the way. The prop's windmilling. Okay, I'm going to let her drop the nose. Get rid of some throttle. Pull on out. I mean, is that amazing or what? Full aileron control. And it's just, it's bumping his nose down like, let me fly. I, I I haven't flown a plane like that. Okay, inverted flight. Uh, Alex was saying uh, needs a little bit of uh, of throttle and 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 uh, quite a bit of down, and it does. It really does. Now I'm flying her right now on about 60% throttle, and we're gonna go ahead and do a circuit. So there she is. She's still upside down, flying around here, looking for all the world to be dead wrong, because it is. Mustangs don't normally fly like that. I haven't touched the throttle. I'm just manipulating it via the stick. And uh, as you can see, the plane does very well upside down. Now the motor is a, it's, a, it's an Exceed RC, uh, basically the equivalent of a Park 450. It's an 890 kV, so it's real uh, uh, low kV. But uh, apparently it has a lot of torque. <laughs> it's, uh, it's a 2835, I think, so 20 millimeters uh, in diameter and about 35 in length, I think, 36 in length. So, yeah, it's a real torquey motor. Um, I'm running a 9.6 prop on it. But as you can see, that's its slow flight capability right there. It just, it's just, how many Mustangs do you have that you can... You can fly like that. I mean, really. Not many, you know? I mean, just really. 
kind of puttered around the uh, the uh, uh, soccer field almost in a high alpha. And I'm not going to go over that goalpost there because these little kids. I don't want them to go right over the kids. But uh, but yeah, it's an amazing model. It really is. Really uh, neat to, to set up your approaches with and just sort of get it going and do some little touch and goes and all that. And, and the thing I like about it is I'm not even worried at, 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 uh, at low altitudes to really get aggressive on those controls. You see when I bumped off, I kind of I kind of pitched her to the right uh, a little bit, and I'm not worried at all about it because I have plenty. I, I have total control over the aircraft, so it's not like, oh golly, I'm going to crash. There's there's no there's no panic mode. It's just the model just flies so wonderfully. So let's set her up into the wind here. Let's try and land her at our at our feet. Let's see what we got going on right here. And there we are. All right. Okay, well, hey, thanks uh, for coming out here to the field with me. I hope you appreciate and uh, enjoy the flight. More to come.